Here we have a 1980 Turbo Trans Am with 103 original miles. Dave right there. Sticker number one. Huh? Sticker, original one. Factory sticker. Dealer plastic. Five miles. Boost radio. You want to tell, tell the story about the car? Excuse tell me? The, you want to tell the story about the car? Well, it was found in a garage over here in uh, Atlanta, uh, 30345 zip code. Um, when I found it, um, the party that owned it was is deceased. So I didn't know a lot of history on the car other than the neighbor that was in his 80s walked over and said he hadn't seen the car since they pulled it in the garage and shut the door. Um, so it was uh, basically had a layer of dust on it. And it's been wa detailed, m minimal detail job on it, and um, and waxed. One new poly steel tire, three original, one separated. This is a new one. I think so. Yeah, I think that may be the. I can't really tell them apart. To be honest, we have to get it. it was one? It was the one of the rear ones? These are hard to find tires. They're available. They're they're uh, they're not cheap. So that's pretty much it. The, uh, the documentation I got was all the owner's manuals, some uh, in, um, delivery sheets. I don't have the original bill of sale. I can't find that. I got the delivery sheet and some inspection reports and a recall with the original owner's information on them. Um, Did you have a new gas tank put in? Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, new gas tank. But there's nothing on top of the gas tank when you pulled it? Um, you know, I need to check on that. Um, yeah, the bill sheet possibly could have been there. Um, I don't think it was there. I'm sure they would. Huh? I'm sure. I hope they told you. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, uh, that's about it. The uh, original decals are still with the car. These have not been removed. Here we go here, Mitch. All right. Didn't fall. We bought a camber Pontiac. It was a Mazda GMC dealership in Atlanta when the car was purchased. So the original... 11951 Additional equipment. Wheel locks, $34 extra. <laughs> yeah, that's that. That's pretty cool. What are those original photos? This is when they, this is when the neighbor told me they pulled it in the garage. The guy across the street. I think there's one more in the trunk. I actually purchased this this uh, '72 Mini Trail with the car. Okay. I got I got that. And um, there's a Corvette. This was in the '80s, of course. Like there was a Corvette in the garage when I bought it. So the garage wasn't have any storage stuff in it. And then the um, same place the car was purchased. Show me the stickers. Original. All the original decals. Pies of Pontiac hadn't been around in 25 years. It's, uh -huh. The car wasn't purchased there. It was purchased at Tambor. Tambor. A Buckhead. Buckhead, yep. Um, Buckhead, Atlanta. So the original decals. All the original decals. Very cool. And 
No, that's not for this car. That's okay. Why don't you pop the hood for me? There's one more. It's in the front. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's in the front. <laughs> To answer your question, the the charcoal color paint is perfect. There's no buff issues going on there. Yeah, you got your mark right there. Yeah. You got your decal right there. Some chipping right there. Isn't that crazy? You still got the white grease on the. Yeah, the yeah that's factory. pretty good. Factory. Yeah, factory is pretty well. Um, let's go ahead and crank her up. Up right here. That was only pretty much the only scratch that I found. Okay. That little. I barely see it. Yeah. yeah. Get some shots underneath. There should be some <laughs> stickers. Uh. Yep, yeah, this is definitely a uh, 103 mile car. That's no question. There's no question. <laughs> Miles. Yeah, 105 miles. There you go. <laughs> All right. So there's an in-depth video of the car. Let me go. Can I start it again? Yeah, sure. Why is reaching in? No gas in the car. Leave everything alone. So, all right.
Okay, I think that's it. Lights are on. All right, there you go, 105 miles original.